A rabbit's teeth will constantly grow throughout their life. Rabbits have 28 teeth, 16 at the top of their mouth and 12 at the bottom. This includes 4 incisors, 2 auxiliary incisors, 10 premolars, and 12 molars. They have special teeth that are open-rooted, meaning that they never grow to a certain length but continuously produce new tooth material. As a result, a rabbit's teeth will grow almost 5 inches in a year. That is why it's essential to keep them short and sharp. Keep watching to learn tips and tricks for keeping your rabbit's teeth short and healthy. Give them hay. You should already be providing your rabbit with plenty of hay of all types. One hay should comprise around 90% of your rabbit's diet since it contains long fibers and other nutrients that only hay can provide. Timothy hay is important for rabbits to have, as it helps them wear down their back teeth, molars, and keep them short. Rabbits chew the hay in a side-to-side -side grinding motion, which is the only way to reliably and efficiently wear down the ever-growing teeth at the back of their mouth. Hay is beneficial to rabbits, and they can have as much as they like, so always ensure they have a fresh daily supply. Wooden Blocks Wooden blocks and toys made of wood, such as untreated, kiln-dried pine, not fresh, are great toys for rabbits to play with. They offer a satisfying chew that can keep their sharp teeth in shape. Some woods are less suitable than others, and some are potentially toxic, but most wooden toys marketed for rabbits should be safe for them to chew. While rabbits will avoid swallowing any wood that they chew, make sure to monitor them while they're nibbling away. Swallowed wood can become lodged in the stomach and cause obstruction. Twigs and branches. Similar to wooden toys and blocks, rabbits will love indulging their wild chewing instinct by gnawing on twigs and branches. It's advisable to buy these already dried from a pet store, as it can be easy to misidentify types of wood. However, a few branches should never be given to rabbits as they are toxic. Cardboard. An alternative to wood and branches is cardboard. Cardboard that is non-printed, free of ink, can serve as a chew toy for your rabbit while also offering some enrichment. As with all chew toys, keep an eye on your rabbit when they're chewing cardboard. Remove the item if you notice your rabbit consuming the cardboard. Nourish your pet from the inside out with wild Alaskan salmon oil. Sourced from the wild, pristine waters of Alaska, our oil is packed with essential omega-3 fatty acids that promote a shiny coat, support joint health, and boost the immune system. Give your furry friend the gift of optimal health and vitality with wild Alaskan salmon oil. Go to bemixpets.com and get 22% off. Check their teeth. An essential part of keeping your rabbit's teeth short is checking them regularly for signs of overgrowth. Most rabbits won't like you touching their mouths for very long, so only a quick look is needed to ensure the teeth look healthy and are at the correct length. However, if your rabbit's teeth start to look yellow or crooked, they require veterinary assistance. Keep in mind that you'll only be able to see the front teeth, the incisors, when checking the length, so keep up to date with your rabbit's vet checkup so they can look further in the mouth. Know the signs of problems. Knowing the signs of dental problems in rabbits is just as important as checking when keeping their teeth short. The most common reason rabbits stop eating is dental problems and overgrowth, which is extremely detrimental. If a rabbit stops eating, their gut motility, movement, slows and can stop altogether. Get them bird. If your rabbit has teeth that are misaligned or have other problems that prevent them from keeping them short, they will have to go to the vet to get them burred. Burring is the process of filing down a rabbit's teeth, usually with an electric file, while under anesthetic. Rabbit teeth used to be clipped, but burring has replaced the method because of the risk of infection and splitting. Likewise, you shouldn't try to file your rabbit's teeth yourself. Why is it important to keep my rabbit's teeth short? If a rabbit's teeth are allowed to overgrow or become misaligned, it can cause serious problems for their health and welfare. The main problem is that overgrown teeth get sharp and cause acute pain as they cut into the mouth's soft tissue. Teeth that grow too long can prevent a rabbit from eating, leading to a condition known as gut stasis. In gut stasis, the rabbit's digestive system slows to a stop. Bacteria in the gut then become unbalanced, leading to stomach swelling and further inapidence. This can rapidly become fatal, so keeping your rabbit's teeth short is crucial. Because of how a rabbit's teeth grow, teeth that get too long can also have elongated roots. These can then grow up into the face and the eyes, causing weeping eyes and abscesses. Infections, the loss of teeth, and large amounts of pain can all occur from poor dentition. Keeping your rabbit's teeth short and giving them all the hay they want is a critical part of their care. Thank you for watching today's video. Please like, share and subscribe for more informative content about diabetes and nutrition. Stay healthy and take care.